My name is Ivan Roque, and I'm a Cuban-American artist based here out of Miami, Florida. The work I mainly do is murals, canvas works, and a little bit of street art. So this is the Bird of Paradise mural. We have like the vines coming out of a singular flower. Uh, most of the time, the vines tend to be the centerpiece. Of the, of the whole wall, but this time, you know, the main focus is kind of the bird of paradise flower. The way I made my work, um, you know, aside from it being, you know, just a, a pretty uh, picture, like a, or like, an, like an animal and flowers, you know, make it all dainty and very uh, commercial, some would say, but there's much more meaning to that. The choice of the animal has meaning. The vines have meaning. The flowers have meaning. It's almost a symbolism, right? Of like, of like how Miami has came, you know, it's like this, beautiful city that just popped out of nowhere and like all these magical things just came out of it and this whole coach just sprouted out of nowhere, you know? I was born around this culture. I was born around my peers that we're all first generation immigrants, you know? And, we're, and we have a voice and we have something to say. And I believe Miami is the epitome of that. It's, the, it's like the melting pot of Latin America and the Caribbean. Little Haiti was uh, Lemon City prior uh, to the, the Haitian exodus that occurred. The conch is a symbol of the Republic and civilization and the people and everything. So the whole idea was, you know, I wanted to have Haitian man's hand holding up the, the conch you know, and through that conch, a whole new life sprouts out right out of it, and your life begins. It wasn't until I got to college that I actually came and I drove through Wynwood and I started and I started seeing all like the, the murals and the graffiti and like the spray painting, and it was it was it was mind blowing. Uh, this mural was specific, actually, right here. You know, it was uh, it was done. It was one of the first murals that in Wynwood that I came here and I got inspired by them. About Wynwood was that it pushed the locals to become much better. You get me? Because we surrounded ourselves with such world class artwork. You get me? That uh, that we had to compete with that. You get me? We had to we had to bring ourselves up a couple notches as well. I want people to know that what I'm doing is not only for myself, that it's for everyone, you know, to know that I am Miami, I am a part of Miami culture, and I want to have at least my thread within the fabric of what is the history of Miami's art.